Hello. Welcome. Happy Saturday. Hope everybody's doing all right. Um, seeing you tuning in. Gabrielle, hello from Germany. Wonderful to see you. Julie, nice to see you. Kerstin, great to see you. Guillermo, welcome. Oh, I'm so glad that you're here in Madrid as well. Thanks for joining us. Thanks for joining us in Boston. Thanks for joining us in Maryland. Hi, Jenny. Nice to see you. Long time no see. Oh, I'm happy to have you here from if, Oregon. If you're if you're new, this is Shannon. I'm Matt. Yes, and you're very welcome to this mid-tempo play-along session. We'll try to accommodate requests as we go. We have so many requests from last week that we're going to try to get to today, but please let us know what you'd like to play. Let us know if you'd like to go faster or slower, and we'll do our best to accommodate as many people as we can. So we'll start with a warm-up today, the Maid on the Green, a jig in G. I'll write it down. <laughs> On the green. You want to say right. something nice to the people? I am so looking forward to sitting down and playing some tunes at the moment. So, did I do it? I think you did it. I didn't. Do no, it. you didn't do it. There we go. There we go. All right. How fast we're going here? Up and down, really nice and slowly to warm up. Here we go in the key of G. <laughs> I know that tune is in the key of G because a lot of G chords are implied by the melody and also it starts and it ends on a G that's a real tip off there so that was the made on the green in G a nice steady warm-up jig for us all so glad you're tuning in from Italy and Paris and Spain so lovely to have you all here we're in Boston Massachusetts where we our family and many of our neighbors do not leave the house at all only for the grocery store um, and, and, walks. and walks and yeah. walks with masks on but we try mm. to pick very uncrowded routes mm. that is what we here in Boston are doing you may be hearing in Europe uh, news from our country we have a very large country and there's lots of different behavior going on uh, it's sort of a state-by-state state mandate and also uh, we have you know sometimes some obscured messaging going on um, but here in Boston we're trying to Keep each other safe and uh, yeah. keep yeah, good gonna, cheer and play tunes. We're going to so. do it with a set of reels. Yes. yes. So next up, again, trying to accommodate requests. If you have requests today, we'll do our best. And here are some requests from last time. Joe Cooley's reel in E minor and Devaney's goat in D. So Cooley's for Lisa and Devaney's goat for Niall and Belfast. I'll write those down. And we'll go kind of kind of moderate, kind of moderate-y, not slow, but moderate. And E minor, e minor, something you're going to be addressing tomorrow. That's true. That's true. I did a little um, YouTube 
tutorial video. I'm, I'm uh, Shannon's letting me do guest spots on on the YouTube channel. It's very it's very nice. It's very nice. It's yeah. very helpful. I think for guitar players. Thanks for doing it. Well, here's here's hoping. <laughs> so not too fast. Again, let us know if you want us to adjust the speed a bit. Yo, one, two. <laughs> Thank you. 
chanted to Jenny Dang the Weaver, a great old Scottish tune that's played a lot in Cape Breton. And we'll send that out to our friends in Nova Scotia. Thanks for the request there and hope that you're doing well. And we're so sorry. Um, so a beautiful tune. I'll write that in the um, comments. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah, one, the, the, so obviously it's, it's much nicer to, to play tunes in person. However, the two uh, unexpected advantages of this situation are one, obviously getting to getting to connect with people from much farther away than would be able to show up at the local session. But two, much easier to change speed in the session if we need to, isn't it, Shannon Heaton? Yes. Yes, if we need if we need to slow down midway, uh, much easier than doing with a group of people. So this is. <laughs> All right, so let us know if other people seem to be um, not getting a strong enough signal. We seem to what have a mean, like pretty strong one. Yeah, not loud enough. We yeah. seem to have a pretty strong one on our end. But, um, yeah, we can always turn the gain up, but we don't want to... move the mic closer. We could move the Make mic closer. Easier. Yeah. Clunkety clunk. Clunkety clunk. Yeah. We'll try that. You can let us know how it goes. Yeah. Um, so, folks... Scientific operation. Next up. Uh, we had a request for the Ara Mountains, which is a slip jig in A minor, and Hardeman the Fiddler, which is on the guided session list for our regular second Saturday meetups in Somerville, Massachusetts. That's what this uh, was aiming. This was the aiming to fill that void of no longer being able to meet up, or at least not for a good long while. So, um, and the silver lining is that we get to connect with folks who aren't in Somerville. So we'll try these two slip jigs for you. I'll write them down. So A minor and D, D mix, D modal, however you like to say it. Personally, I'm looking forward to that. I noticed last week, I don't feel like we played much A minor, so this is really exciting for me, Shannon. I'm, I'm really glad that you're excited. Yeah. I hope you're excited too. Okay, and then, great. Those are nice. Um, strong in Connecticut, John says. Okay, good, so good. good. All, right. All right, why don't you give us a nice slip jig um, thing while I write some things down here. <laughs>
How's the volume? Any better? Any Let different? us know. Who knows? We'll turn it up <laughs> if you need. Um, yay. So yeah. Actually, if there, are, if there are any experts in YouTube streaming out there, I'd love to have a chat with you later about a couple issues. Nice. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. Nice crowdsourcing. Yeah, that that's what I'm doing. What so are, what's what up next? next? What do we need next? We need uh, maybe a waltz. Somebody had requested Woodland Waltz. That's very flattering. It's a tune that I wrote, and it was really intended to be a tune that would be easy to manage for the simple flute players, simple system flute players out there. Or simple flute players. <laughs> it's in the key of A major, but there are no G sharps, and it doesn't go up high, or you don't have to play a G sharp. Hmm. Um, do you remember it? Uh, it goes like this. I'll do it a couple times around. Oh, yeah, I'll write it down. Yeah. Could use a bit more volume. Okay, let's do it. Let's All right, do I'm it. I'm just going to turn up the... We're, ladies and gentlemen, we are turning up the oh preamp. God. Oh, oh we can't reach it. We oh can't reach God. the preamp. Okay. Uh, can I do anything here? Is it on here? the left? It is the one on the left, yeah. Okay. Here we go. Oh, yeah. Just a little. 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 Well, keep trying. Thanks, folks. <laughs> okay. Da, da. Hi, Val. It's just, it's just like playing in a pub. You can't hear the music. So. <laughs> okay, let us know if the volume is better now. One, two, three, one. Oops, I forgot to write it down again. Oh my gosh. <laughs> All right. Woodland Waltz. <laughs> A major. All right, here we go. One, two, three, one, two. <laughs> the volume is loud enough to hear the peanut gallery asking for a snack uh, from the other room. Uh, will I go and get a snack for the boys? Yes. Okay. Yes, um, you may. Maybe Shannon will play one for you. Okay, oh, yes, because of course, as I say many times, this is a complete melodic tradition all on its own. You've got the rhythm and the melody and the implied chords all there when you're just one person playing a tune. So um, Mel, while Matt arranges some Rice Krispies for our son and heir, I will play a few, um, I'll play some reels. The Hare's Paw and the Laurel Tree and the Traveler. So here we go, Hare's Paw, which is in G. There's a lot of E minor in it too. The Laurel Tree. Uh, which is an A minor, and I think that um, Patty O'Brien from Tipperary wrote it. And The Traveler, which is one of my favorite tunes of all time. It's also known as The Carpenter's Reel, and it's uh, we'll play it in the key of G. All right, so here we go. One, 
two, not too fast. Is this okay? I hope. some gifts for me as well. This is so exciting. I'm going to have beer and a glass. Yeah, which one would you want? Um, I think I want this one here, okay. that lovely. Um, so great. Uh, what are we going to do next? We're going to do some jigs. We're going to play the Banks of Loch Ghana for uh, Roseanne and Christy Berries for Ashlane because you guys requested that last time around. And then I think we might do the old... Oh, thank you. 
No, no. Yeah, here, I want my it. bowl. Yeah, I get it. Um, uh, here we go. Cheers. And cheers, cheers to you, whatever you're drinking, wherever you are. We we'll, we hope that you're very happy at the moment, playing some tunes along with us. And um, yes, after this set of jigs, we're gonna mm. take a tiny pause and pass the tip jar around. This is what we do in our in-person session mm. on our second Saturday session. Um, so we have a virtual tip jar below, only if you are still being paid to work mm. and you can spare a little, we really appreciate it. Um, of course, all of our work has been canceled indefinitely and probably much of yours. So above all, just join us and play tunes. And, um, but for the uh, tip jar, we always play an offertory. Mm. So um, I have an idea for that, okay. which is going off okay. book. Um, okay. But first, we're going to play some um, jigs. Jigs. Let, we're going to thanks play the Blancana and Christy Berries. And Christy Berries. Oh, so, mm. yeah, D and G, although the first one, I think, starts on B minor. Oh, okay, good, good. Banks. At least that's what I'm going to play. Of Lake Gauna, is that how you spell it? Sure. B mine slash... Um, B mine slash D. D, mm. okay. I would say D slash B minor. Um, and then Christy Berries. Will we do both? I'm not sure. Um, at least we'll do one of them. I will, I will offer the opinion that if you've got a tune that kind of is a little... Uh, uh, can't decide what key it's in... Uh, if you're shouting at your guitar player, if you know what the first chord should be, like you could call it, I mean, I would say B minor for that tune because then you get a B minor on the downbeat. Good, good call. That's I good. love that people are saying hi to each other and know each other. Oh my gosh, it makes me so happy. And I love that we're tuning in from all over the world. So, hey, uh, it was about are. time that we all come together, yeah. right? It was long overdue. It was weird that we were going on so long without doing this. Here we go. One, two, three. Here we go. Right? Yeah, okay. I think so. Okay. Two, three, four. Yeah, I think so. Ah, okay, that's how it goes. So, if you were Shannon Heaton, you might have written down on your little thing B B A F F E F D. That's how I remember how a tune starts. Here we go. Banks of Locano. <laughs> One, two. Go ahead, Maestro. Two, three. <laughs>
Ah. Mm. So I didn't know if we'd do just one Christy Berries. And in fact, we kind of did both inadvertently. There you go. We played the A parts of the first tune and then slipped into the B parts of the second tune and then just played the second which tune is, from there. Which is the very <clears throat> traditional way of doing it. <clears throat> which is not great leadership, in all fairness. You're cut off from your beer. <laughs> yeah, I know. Two sips of Two beer. Two sips. And, all and I don't know how the lot. tune goes. Yeah. Those are not tunes that I play very frequently, Fair in enough. all fairness. Fair so I shouldn't have played them. Sorry. Uh, yeah, so Christy Berry's jigs, though, definitely worth We're all them. friends here. We're all friends here. It's okay. <laughs> um, so we're going to carry on now with our offertory hymn. Right. And, um, Shannon, where, little Shannon, where is, where is that um, tip jar link? So you... it's in the, uh, should be in the, you description? know, in the description. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah. Right. So, yes, there's a PayPal link if you feel, if you are <laughs> willing and able um, to contribute to the cause. And we are going to play what? Yes. So we have people tuning in from Argentina. Oh my gosh. Which is just one of our favorite places. We've never been there. We would love to go someday. I can't wait until we can go and... Wonderful. So one of our most um, favorite types of music is tango music, uh, especially the new stuff, like the Astor Piazzolla and beyond. Uh, we're so inspired by him. So I wrote a tune. Oh, we're going to do the Piazzolla? Yes, we're going to okay. try it. I wrote a tune very, very, very vaguely, loosely inspired by Maestro Piazzolla. And so we'll try that for you right now. Okay, give it a go. Just by itself. Thanks for tuning in from Argentina <laughs> and for having such wonderful music dance, music and dance culture there. Um, so yay, let's play some Andros. Um, we'll play. <laughs> oh, you can't see the um, wonderful uh, comments asking for a few Breton. Oh, uh, I see, I see. It's happening. So we'll try one in B minor. Okay, B minor. Or F sharp. Um, and uh, then one in E minor. So this okay. is called, what's the first one called? Um, it's beautiful and it's called, are we going to call it B minor? B minor, Andro, plus the Ren in E. Yeah. 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 One, two, one.
minor, I hope. Thanks for the requests. Um, very fun. What's next, folks? Um, heading, heading back to the Heading back Ireland. to requests from, um, yes, Saul, that is, I do have both of those tunes in my book, and I love them. And the E minor one, I remember um, fondly at the New Bedford Festival down in New Bedford, Massachusetts. Um, we were playing the finale concert with a bunch of wonderful musicians, and um, uh, uh, Veronique Plas oh, yeah. um, was a member of the French Canadian band that was beside us. And the two of us saw the presenter say, wrap it up. And somebody was in the middle of playing a tune in E minor, and we both looked at each other and we began playing this tune. And we began processing while playing this tune off of the stage and took all of the musicians from the stage out onto the street and then the entire audience joined us on the street and we did not stop playing this tune. We played it for about 20 minutes. All the members of the audience were singing the tune with us. It was so sweet and I think of that every time I play the tune. So I'm kind of thinking of you guys all in your homes and we're all playing this together. It's like that moment. You're lucky she didn't get up and walk out. And Santiago, I heard you playing it on uh, the video that you shared. You should share the link with us because it's wonderful. You're playing it with a drone. It's really, really great. Um, so Calavel Jig sounds great. Calavel Jig and um, somebody had requested uh, Brendan Tonraz. Mm. So let's try that. Da, 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 de, de, de. Uh, let's see. <laughs> Da, da, la, da, 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 da. Okay, I have to write down the first few notes so I remember which tune we're changing into, otherwise I'll forget. So the Calavel, Brendan Tonraz, and, and Miss Covered Mountain. Sounds great. Um, Miss Covered Mountain. <laughs> okay, Matt, can you talk to the nice people? I would love to talk to the nice people. Um, Hope you guys are enjoying. I actually saw, uh, as in, I, I'm going to tell you something. I can't actually see the comments at all because they are the. I don't know if there's a way to increase the font size on the uh, on this, but um, I, it's just all looks like a little stream of, of, of things. But I did see enough to see that our, our friend Summer uh, had tuned in, and she is one of the brainchilds behind the Ministry of Folk, which is. Uh, in my opinion, perhaps one of the best named uh, things to come out of this whole this whole situation. 
but Ministry of Folk has all kinds of um, live streaming information and it can connect you with teachers of different things. It's, uh, it's pretty darn and cool. so many great online concerts happening now, of course. Yeah. And in a way, Ministry of Folk helps you sift through so yeah. that you get only the really good... So you get only like great trad events if yeah, that's yeah. something that you're interested in. Yeah, which we assume it is unless you just accidentally tuned into this instead of the Beatles Yellow Submarine sing along. So there you go. So Julie, you asked what the names of the Breton, Breton tunes were. You can actually scroll through the comments behind to see names. Uh, the first one, I can't remember. Um, I'm so sorry. It's called B minor. And the second <laughs> and one the is second called, one is called the, the Ren. But it's in first 50, so maybe somebody There's can tell her what might it's be called. A, yeah. Okay, Kalavel, Brendan Tonraj, Miss Covered Mountain. Keys. E minor mm -hmm. and D and A minor. Thank you. One, two. <laughs>
exciting chord substitutions oh. going on oh, here from Matt you. Heaton. Thank you very much. So if you'd like to learn more about Matt's chord voicings, about the way that he chooses to play his different chords, to voice his different chords, um, he's going to be rolling out um, per key a couple of short videos just with some suggestions. Yeah, so they're all just suggestions. Stay tuned. Tomorrow he's got one coming out on E minor, right, the exciting, honey? The, the, the most exciting list. of all keys. Yeah, E yes. minor. Yeah. Um, so, and speaking of to-do list, mm -hmm. um, I have another idea for all of us here. Um, so we'll do a couple more, and then mm -hmm. we'll close today with She Beg, She More. Mm -hmm. That gives you a little heads up, so if you need to, I don't know, practice it or something, find we, it. We can't hear you, so. Um, but I have the idea. Oh. So these, yes, are archived um, for better and for weirder <laughs> um, because it feels like a very in-the-moment thing. So it's a little embarrassing that they're archived. Um, but, you know, hey, uh, then you can play along with them again. You can cut it to 75% or 50% playback if you want it even slower. Okay, you can do that yeah. in real time as well. I believe now? so. Now? Really? I think so. Mm -hmm. Whoa. Yeah, pretty cool. Um, and what if we start <laughs> talking? Oh, sorry, go ahead. So the wonderful She Beg, She More, yeah. I have the idea. This will be archived, you know, like it'll be up in about an hour, probably it takes a little time to process or whatever. And then you could listen to it on headphones and play She Beg, She More along with it, a recording. Email me your recording oh. and I'll sync up all of our recordings and I'll share it with you on the YouTube do you, channel. Do you want to do it as a video or as, a, as an audio? Whatever's easy for folks. Whatever's easy. I mean, video is always fun. Yeah. Um, but even but maybe if you, audio, is e audio would be easier it, if you get a bunch of them. Yeah, yeah, I think audio. Audio. I think audio. 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 Audio, audio for now. And we're, maybe not, we're, not that, we're not that good at video yet. Clearly. <laughs> <laughs> so anyway, just heads up. I'll explain that concept once again before we finish. Mm. So, um, great. The musical priest. Uh, uh, <laughs> I think that's the music called musical, musical Priest. I have to write down the first few notes. Da -de -da -da -da. Um, <laughs> I like that we sound really drunk at 50%, um, <laughs> but we don't at 100%. Um, okay, so we're going to play the Musical Priest and any other reel that your little heart desires, folks. Musical Priest. Um, this is going to be the last set before she begs you more. I'm looking. So that's in B minor. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Musical priest in B minor. It's a three parter. And we don't know what we're doing with it? We don't know what we're doing with it yet. All right. Um, should we go looking? to D? We should go to D. Mm -hmm. Good. Good call, Matt Heaton. Any D reels mm -hmm. out there, Guillermo? You're always so quick with great reel suggestions. <laughs> Let's see here. Well, about, let's pick something from what the. About Charlie Harris's. Yeah, let's do Donald oh. Blue from the um, mm -hmm. guided session mm. list. Okay, that's what we're gonna do. Musical priest in B minor, Donald Blue. That was like really loud. Yeah, it was a bad drink. One. Sorry, it was really gross. That, yes. You keep moving away from the nice people. Well, I, okay. No. One, two, done. <laughs> that was my boom block. <laughs>
I'm seeing all your great suggestions and we'll try to add them in next week for sure. Um, so yes, we're going to keep this going. Thanks to everybody for tuning in. We love for getting to connect with you. In. And to my family in California. Aww. Hi, Murphys. Oh, I love you and I miss you. And I want you to be so well. Do you want to watch Tunes for Flying? Um, I don't know what you're saying. Tunes for Flying? Um, mm-hmm. Sure, right, right. And then um, for a slightly faster session. So this is meant to be mid-tempo. And again, just be in touch with us. Let us know what you need. If you need it faster, slower in the future. We really want this to work for as many people, median, as we can. Um, uh, So on Monday and on Thursdays, Mary always has a great virtual session that's a little faster. You get to hear from a lot of our good friends playing uh, music. We're going to be guests on Monday night. Um, Tune in, if you like, and play along. Also on YouTube, right? Also on YouTube. Mm -hmm. You can find out at tune.supply. And again, my idea. Is it tune.supply? That's right. That's incredible. Yes. Okay. Okay, so folks... If you feel it, after this is archived, or right now, if you've got an easy way to um, record yourselves, go ahead and play along with us playing She Begs She More. Um, just audio recording in any old way that you want. Email it to me. You can send it through shannonheatonmusic.com. Um, and I'll try to sync it all up um, if enough people, if a few people yeah. go right in. What It'd be heck? nice for us to play together. So um, here we go. She Begs She More. Be so well. Thanks for tuning in. Keys in? D. D. In the key of D. Oh, I forgot to write it in. That was my bad. Oh, what format do we prefer? Doesn't matter. Um, MP3, maybe. Yeah, MP3 is easiest to. Wave file is a bit big. Wave file is a bit big. Yeah. Since, since, yeah. Well, Well, since this is the first attempt at this particular thing, MP3 sounds good. Yeah, but Wave also sounds good, and if you want to retransfer that, that's fine. That's great. They're all great. They're all great, and you're all great. And our son says MP3 is better. Okay, she beg, she more. start together right we should count it in that's right good one two three one two three here we oh we can do it a little faster okay a one two three one two three everybody here we
Thanks, everybody. See you next week. Take care. Hit the instrument.